I'm live. Hello. Uh, and only a minute late. I'm still getting used to this with comments. There's a there's a thing where I can make a comment. So it says say something. So I'm going to say hi, y'all. Uh, hi. Um, okay, let's get right to it. I hope you're doing okay. Um, the uh, the situation is ever shifting. Um, I hope you're all safe where you are. I hope you're social distancing. Don't touch your face. Don't touch your face. Um, I've washed my hands excessively. I've also not, you know, had contact with another person in a while. So I get to do this. It's all I have now. Um, okay, let's get drawing. I have paper somewhere over there. Paper from yesterday, hence the ink already on it. All right, let me tilt down. Let's see. Get this together. Oh, the light metering is confused by what I'm doing. Let's see if I can help it out some. Nope, no, I can't. Not with that pre preset. That helps some. Okay. All right. Um, and can I possibly get this a little bit straighter? I use a mouse. Um, oh, that's the angle I need to tilt. Okay. I see. Oh, I see. I see. I see. Sorry. Fascinating stuff. Let's dispense with it. Um, a little higher. There we go. Yes, it's the zombie apocalypse, but I still want my paper to be kind of straight, but I'm giving up now. Almost. I am. I am. I am. Stop it. Stop it. Get drawing. Go. Um, as ever. A trusty toothbrush. You know what? I'm going to do the thing that I did yesterday because it actually worked out okay. I'm going to put down a little bit of colored ink. And um, let that dry while I make a monster with black ink. All right, here we go. Okay. Well, that's sort of immediately suggestive. That's just a gimme. We're gonna just set that aside for a second. Let that dry and Get going with the black ink. All right. Let's just have this a little bit higher. Look at that. Better. Better. I see that there are four of you watching. Which is lovely. And someone just liked, which I also appreciate. Ah! So, um, anything with. But could also be excellent. Um, hmm. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, well, sure, okay. I see it now. Um,. Well, we'll make this a very quick sort of warm-up one. I think this is once I once I saw it, it ends up being very simple. Um, but that is okay. Um, all right, pen, 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 pen. Here we go. Uh, 
I have to do a little bit of business down here. Um, to let everything up here dry for a second. Strange days. I really hope you're hanging in there. Not getting too, too freaked out. Not getting too, too bored. I wish there was a little bit of maybe background music or something. Like uh, sort of like um, Probably be a copyright strike. Hey Dan. Hey Heather. Um it is so it's so nice to hear another human. Yeah. <laughs> um I wish I could hear you guys. I wish I, I wish this was a call-in format. You know, maybe as we go on there's a there's some way of making that happen. Because I would like that also. I'm so happy to have these that you're commenting. That was for the for the first test yesterday. It was sort of really disconcerting to be talking into a vacuum. I mean, I know that I'd done it with a previous monster series, but then there was also this kind of like, okay, well, I can edit or I can stop and restart that sort of thing. But it's very nice to know you're out there and to do it together. That actually makes a really big difference for me too. Uh, I'll tell you this: if you're if you're looking to zen out, noodling bark is a pretty good way to go. One of the more satisfying things to draw because it's quite simple. Um, it looks impressive. It's in the parlor trick area. Oh, hi, Katie. Uh, yeah, sorry about <laughs> sorry about drawing it in real time. I uh, wish I could speed myself up, like the Star Trek aliens who exist in another state of phase to the rest of the crew. Um, I'm happy to simulate the fast drawing noises. Just go. Pss, 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 pss. Um, I also hope it's not too loud. I'm very near the microphone at the moment. Um, and so uh, I listened to it back yesterday for a second to check everything. And it seemed to be kind of booming. So I hope that that's not happening today. If it is, let me know and I'll back off or go into sort of a whisperier mode, I suppose. ASMR monsters. Hi. Oh, that, that just creeped me out right there myself. Um, yeah, the sounds are great, right? Um, the, the, that kind of noise, it's sort of, it has something oddly insecty about it. Um, and I was told at some point by a number of people with kids 
that it just put their kids into kind of a standby mode <laughs> where if they were fussy or they were fussy, I guess, I guess there's no, you know, just fussy, um, that it would sort of make them go, grr. Um, and I once asked a child psychologist about it and he told me that it essentially when especially little kids like toddlers hear a sound that they don't understand they go into kind of a safety mode and the safety mode is just like just stand very still and wait for help to arrive <laughs> and so that's what i provided um so, okay, um, in terms of the echo, not sure what to do about it, but I heard that yesterday too. Um, I guess I could put up sound baffles or something, but that would go against the ethos of let's just do this. Um, yeah, I don't know. I have to look into that. Um, as far as the white pen, that would be the jelly roll 08 don't get the jelly roll 07 it's bullshit. um no i i found and um it actually works because i've had many many over many years that didn't work at all um and then finally i found one that works and it, <laughs> it's a miracle it's really fantastic um and i love that yeah it's when you cross a bird with a terrier just yesterday, I made a comment about Jonathan Frakes, number one from Star Trek, um, saying that he was created by crossbreeding a golden retriever with a sea otter and Errol Flynn. So we're getting there. We just need, I guess, Errol Flynn and a sea otter and a golden retriever. Never mind. But crossbreeding, crossbreeding is fun. Um, I'm really, like, I'm trying to figure out if I want to put something here because it just... Feels like maybe it needs something. Um, but also maybe not. I tend to overdo these things, but let's just... Why should today be any different? Creature it's gotta eat. Oh, by the way, Katie, I saw that, uh, that Zay has a Patreon page now and is doing stuff there again. So you might check that out. Things might not go well for this little fly here. Let's see. Or maybe it will go well for the fly. Maybe the fly isn't going to get eaten. But actually, maybe this is some sort of pollinating thing that happens where if the fly gets sucked into the big terrier bird, that um, then they can form some sort of greater joined advanced life form. Maybe Jonathan Frakes. Who knows? Oh, and you just became Zay's patrons this morning. Morning. Excellent. Okay. Um, as far as the proboscis, proboscis, I've seen both. Um, no, 
mean, I sort of, I just, I see a general area where it can go, and then it mostly comes out of the hand. Uh, all right. I think this one's done. I mean, I always want to noodle these things to death, and I may still just put, meh, meh. No, I think this one's done. Let's move on to the next one. So there is Bird Terrier. And in the meantime, this green plot has just about dried. Okay. This one, again, is, you know, it's kind of a gimme. So, the only question now is, Green teeth or not green teeth? Nee, green teeth. Oh, it's <laughs> it's not quite dry yet. I use one of the precious, precious paper products that I still have to blot that out. That's going to be our new currency soon. Is paper products. Like cigarettes and Shawshank. Teeth. Immense, immensely satisfying to draw. Teeth. Hard to say. Fun to draw. Okay. And can we go right in with the eye? Yes. Okay, well that shows up almost not at all on camera. It barely shows up on the paper. So let's cease this foolishness immediately. Black may have been a little bit too heavy in the in the green. We'll see. Adjustments will have to be made. Hi, Catherine. Dan, find your phone. Hi, Katie. Hi, Katie and other guys. So happy to see and hear you too. It is a sea creature with dentures. Maybe it found the dentures from some sort of, you know, maroon sailor. R. Then Charles. Upwards, down. 
Okay. Um, Isn't that green great? Uh, it's the I've mixed it from it was a Dale Rowney Rowney Hellgrün Vert Clair light green with a little bit of um, with a little bit of fluorescent green. When I just have the fluor fluorescent green, it just doesn't show up on camera at all. As with all monsters, I think ultimately this one is another expression of my inner state. Just a, just a poor old angler fish who got obsessed with his own lore or confused by his own lore. getting a thing that says unable to connect to chat right now. Let's see if that'll change. Okay, what to do with the rest of it? Because, I mean, there's sort of a wing slash possibly fin situation happening. But I feel like more, more could be taking place. Hmm. And something should happen here. Is the chat actually offline? Can you still comment? Thank you. 
How interesting, I can see you in the other win. I can see your chats in the other window. Okay, let me switch over to that. Now I can see your comments again, but in my sort of master control window, it's just all stalled. And I was feeling sad and alone because it's it really makes a huge difference with comments and without. So I'm happy to see you again. And yes, he is pouting. Absolutely right. This gets into, oh man, this gets into my personal obsession territory of correct curves. And as soon as you go into it, it, can, it it's easy for it to go off the rails. Um, and the obsession with the curves is essentially just that. When you have an outside curve and an inside curve, they should sort of match, um, which is one of the reasons why guitar pick guards are so fraught for me. It's a time for undulating fronds. That's just how it is. Okay, but I still there's still sort of an unresolved thing that's happening. Um, huh. Hmm. Let's see. Also, have I stalled? She's been using pomade. That's funny. Yes, she has. The comments have sort of become a little bit erratic, so I'm going back and forth between the two windows. Um, hmm. I feel like there's something, there's a potential for monster butt that could potentially be a dangerous aesthetic choice. But let's just see what happens. We'll see in this. 
now opens up the possibility of possibly adding a nice tail Or tail fin, I suppose. Let's see what we can do with that. Ooh. Obviously, I don't want to unbalance all of this, which this may very well do. But no risk, no reward. this black come from? Was that there before? Did I just not see it? Ideally, I would have incorporated it, but well. doing anything with this hmm. maybe just one a teeny tiny one on the distance own little thing going on way back there okay I think <laughs> I'm just seeing the comments come through it won't end well ain't that the truth um, okay so 
I think that may be the monsters for today. I'm going to tilt up. Oh, good Lord. Heart of Darkness. Time, time to switch the profile again. There you go. So we have anglerfish. Oh, see, can't adjust the white balance. That's the problem. We're learning. It's a whole thing. Um, good. Basic features, white balance, temperature auto, maybe? I don't know. None of this is working. Okay, never mind. Um, anyway, monster number one. Monster number two, there's a there's a theme of... Is there a theme? No, I thought there was a theme. There's not really a theme. Uh, if there's a theme, tell me, because... I just does the drawings. Thank you so much for hanging out with me again today. Um, thank you, Dan and Katie and Heather. And um, I'll be here again tomorrow. Um, maybe a little bit later. Maybe we'll do the... Let me know in the comments if you prefer the, the 11.30 Pacific or the 1 p.m. Pacific. And I'll be here again, and I hope you will be too. I loved having you in the comments. That really makes a big difference for me, certainly. Um, be safe. Um, that's really, that's it, right? Be safe and hang tough. And if any of you need somebody to chat with, we could do it here on the stream or, you know, email me or call me. Uh, I'm always here especially now. All right. See you guys all tomorrow.